Looks to center it and knocked off his stick. He's knocked down. The puck will come back to center where Brock Higgs has it over the blue line. Cross ice pass to late man Merrifield. He'll shoot one right pad. Save in a check. The rebound pops in front. The Bolts say Jack and the boys there to help out of the back check. Puck to center. Eric Neely in over the blue line. The Dartmouth grad on the right wing side. He'll shoot one right pad. Save in a check. Big rebound in front. And he makes another right pad save on OJ who chopped it on goal. St. Jack on the draw, it's won by Atlanta, back to Everson along the left wing side, and a huge hit by Humphreys. He just absolutely smokes Vidal, who was looking at the puck, and it went past him, and he got run over. On the backhand of the left point, Jones, with some room to shoot, throws it off the backboards, and retreat there by Des Moines. He cuts out front, he shoots and scores! Welcome back, Derek Des Moines, top corner! The fans on their feet early, it's one to nothing, South Carolina! Feeds it back to neutralize. Five seconds left in the period. Rains will play it forward. Gall will flip it in and then takes a little bit of a jump from Stayskull. Fight gives him one back and then Higgs knocks down Fight and Stayskull swipes it. Fight he's going to drop the gloves and try to swing over the top at Stayskull and he is. He's firing bombs with the linesman in the middle but Stayskull and Fight have hold of each other now and both of them grapple each other down to the ice and Fight is hot. He did not like that hit by Brock Higgs there in the end. He is still trying to pull in the jersey of Stayskull as well as tensions. Finally flare up here in a rather team first period of play in two teams that have really had some bad blood in this month of March. Huck along the right wing side, Zanja. Under some pressure, escapes it, feeds it low to the goal line, Vija. Back to the right point, Humphreys. Wide open left side, Du Bois. Flat pass to the right, Zajac, he shoots and scores! Oh my, what a rocket from Kelly Zajac! A power play goal, and it is two to nothing, Rays! Yeah, beautiful cross, beautiful buck movement starting out with. Shots are 18 to nine in favor of South Carolina. The Glads having a shot in about 10 minutes. Here's St. Jaglin along the right side, half boards. Goes back to Humphreys. He'll shoot one of the goal. They score! Might have been tipped by Devin in front. And the Rays strike again on the power play. It is three to nothing, South Carolina. 120 on the clock in the period. Glad's looking for a late strike here. Atkinson shoots and it hit the inside of the goal post. Murovich, I think, got a piece of it or at least disrupted Vanacek in front. Here's Hangs with it on the right side to Atkinson. Just missed his first goal there. Walks it in along the left wing side. In front to Hangs who shoots one and shut down by Vanacek with a save there. And then fight and just belts Murovich and knocks him to the ice. And that gets everybody upset in front of the goal as Murovich poking at that puck and Austin Fight didn't like that at all. Shea on him, OJ spins around him and shoots and Vanacek again with the save. He got his pad and his stick on the shot on the ice. Back to Stasekul, he'll wind and fire and a save by Vanacek. Penley in front and then Shea knocks the Atlanta player on top of Vanacek and that's gonna charge a huge crowd in front of the goal. Vanacek lost his helmet. Shea is swinging away and firing at Stayskull, who has his stick in his hand and his glove still on. Leach is behind the net, grabbing hold of the Gladiator. We have ourselves a bit of a Donnybrook here as Vanacek was run over. Leach is still trying to get at anybody and everybody. He's trying to get at Neely, who drops his gloves, but the linesman restrains him and takes him into the backbones. Vanacek is on his feet and okay. I forget, I think Marcus Perrier pummeled him in a fight that wasn't even close. Oh, okay. but you know, yeah. you know what? No, I, yeah. no you know Neely what? I'm wrong. Could, yeah, Neely could have Neely stopped. went into Vanacek, and he went in with his hands hard. I yeah. thought Bobby Shea pushed him. He did a little bit from behind, but my apologies. Looking down the scoreboard, Neely went in hard with his hands high on Vanacek, and that's Bush League there. Huck loose along the far side boards now behind the net. Vijay trying to come up with it. McGee and Nesbitt going back after each other, pushing and shoving it in front. Leach is going to come over and grab Nesbitt. Now Neely grabs McGee and starts swinging away, and Pecan and Shea will go after Neely. Goaltender Ginn trying to get there as well. We got a full-scale Donnybrook here. Nesbitt is trying to get at anybody. Now it's Stayskull swinging away at a Stingray in front of the net. Joey Leach, everyone grabbing hold of each other here. We got a darn near line brawl in front of the net. Only one full-scale fight is Leach and Stayskull battling. Stayskull with a short right. Shea being pushed towards the penalty box here is Pecan getting involved with Frazee. As Leach and Stayskull are done, we'll get to their feet. Penley box area, Murovich wants to talk to Ray behind glass. As it's with McGee in front of the goal, then Leach came over to Nesbitt. McGee came back and then a hack on the back of Nesbitt. And then Neely came over and started swinging away at McGee before he could really get his balance or drop his gloves. That's when Pecan or Shank came in. You got a possible third man in situation yeah, here. Absolutely. You got multiple fights, continuing altercations. This is going to take a while to sort out. Right side to Atkinson here. Feeds a puck, loaded Nesbitt along the right side, half board. 
Cross-size pass, Everson will shoot one, deflected score. Frazee, a power play goal with 9.01 to go in the third period of play. A shot from the left side redirected in, and the Gladiators are down by two. Puck knocked away, Caleb Herbert gets the puck to Patrick Gall at center. Again, the range down to four defensemen here. Here's Gall in over the blue line, that's fine to the net, Gall. He shoots and scores! Patrick Gall with that insurance right there. The double news strikes, and South Carolina leads four to one. Picked up, he's got it again. 20 on the power play, here's a slap shot in front. Blocker saved by Vanacek through traffic. To the left point, the glance hold it in. A wrist shot in front, score. Uh, and Snuck just through when Vanacek. I said that. And it's 4-2 with 104 to play. That one somehow rolled through past the Stingrays netwinder. Final seconds, a great crowd on hand and a win for the Stingrays. Vanacek and Murovich chopping with each other. And that'll do it, the Stingrays win 4-2 the final score. As the Stingrays get the victory on a big night for Kelly's Ajax.